Hello, this is Chow from BuildWe.com. I have returned to answer more questions relating to my previous video, how to build your own Wii in ten minutes. Today's question is: How is the sensor bar connected to the laptop? The short answer for this question is: The sensor bar does not need to be connected to the laptop. If you are still interested. Here's the longer version of the answer. To answer this question properly, we must first go over one of the biggest misconceptions about how the Wii system works. For many people, the sensing component of the Wii system is the sensor bar. In this view, the motion of the Wii remote is picked up by the sensor bar, and then this information is transmitted to the Wii system via this cable. But this cannot be further from the truth. Here comes the shocker: the sensor bar does not sense anything. In reality, the sensor bar only emits infrared light from its four LEDs. The sensing component is in fact the Wii remote. If you look at the front of your Wii remote, you will see a black region. Behind there. Is a small camera that sees infrared light. This is what the camera sees. Now, if you move the Wii remote to the left, the light on the sensor bar will move in the opposite direction, to the right, and vice versa. When you move the Wii remote closer to the sensor bar, however, the dots will become bigger, as well as the distance between them will grow. So what this means is that by observing the motion of the infrared dots, we can tell how the Wii remote is moving, and then this information is transmitted to the Wii system wirelessly via Bluetooth technology. This brings us to the final piece of the puzzle: what the heck is this cable for? And the answer is. This cable, when connected to the Wii system, provides power for our sensor bar. So, in fact, you can pretty much replace the sensor bar with a couple of candles, and our Wii system will still work. So now you may ask: So why do we have to build our own sensor bar? Well, don't you find it a little bit troublesome to having to light up candles every time you want to play a Wii game? And the second reason is, we don't want you to burn your house down. Okay, a quick recap on what we have learned today. This is what a real Wii system looked like. What we have done is to replace the Wii console with a laptop and a Bluetooth dongle, and then we built a custom-made sensor bar to replace the Wii sensor bar. Together with the sensor bar, the Wii remote detects its own motion and transmits this information via Bluetooth technology to our laptop. And there, ladies and gentlemen, is why the sensor bar does not need to be connected to our laptop, and how our system works. For further information, please check out my website at buildwii.com.